Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh Dear friends, Abdul Kalu Jilani was an eminent Islamic scholar born in 19th century in Persia. Since from the childhood, he was very lucky with the pious mother who encouraged him to acquire knowledge. At the age of 18, he asked her permission to his mother for traveling to Baghdad. On hearing this, the mother was very happy to send her son to seek the path of Islamic knowledge. And she gave some money and she sewed it on his shirt. Before Abdul Qadir Jilani joined the caravan to travel to Baghdad, her parting advice to her son, whenever you speak, speak only truth. Remember Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, Inna sidduka yahdi ilal birri wa inna al birra yahdi ilal jannah. Truthfulness leads to rightness and rightness leads to paradise. The Quran also tells us, Oh you believe, be careful of your duty to God and be with truthful. In route to Baghdad, the caravan was assaulted by a band of robbers. As the thugs began, all extract the valuable things from the traveler. One of the robbers started searching Abdul Qadir's belongings. While searching, he asked to Abdul Qadir Jilani, Do you have anything valuable? Abdul Qadir Jilani calmly replied, Yes. On hearing this, the robber frantically searched further but he couldn't find anything. He took Abdul Qadir Jilani to his leader and he said, He says, he has a valuable thing but I couldn't find anything. The leader of the robber asked to Abdul Qadir Jilani, Are you hiding anything valuable? Abdul Qadir Jilani replied, Yes. What are you hiding? Abdul Qadir Jilani calmly replied, 40 gold coins. Upon further searching, the robber were discovered the gold coins which is sweet in Abdul Qadir's court. Thus all robbers were wondered and curious to know all about the brilliant boy. Leader of the robber asked to Abdul Qadir Jilani, Why you don't say lie? You say I have money. Abdul Qadir Jilani replied, My mother told me speak only truth. He embraced Abdul Qadir Jilani and asked for forgiveness. I conclude my words.